Welcome to this tutorial. First, we're going to create two tables, main table and sidebar table. The sidebar table contains SID and a name, and the uh, main table contains MID, SID, and a name fields. These two tables are linked by the SID field. The sidebar table will contain the names of the menu and the uh, main table will contain the PHP files which will be displayed in the main areas. Once tables are created, we need to have forms to populate those two tables. Also, we need to create record sets before we can use those two forms to insert records into the database. After that, we're going to apply the insert record uh, server behavior to these two forms. Once forms are completed, we need to um, have two dynamic tables to display the data being entered from the forms.
Okay, here is the important part. Um, I'm gonna transform the PHP file name into the real PHP file by convert the echo command into include command. By doing so, um, the web the PHP page will be displayed on the main area. Also, I have to put in the if statement uh, to make sure there is no error coming up when the page is loaded at the first time. First, I'm going to change the text uh, in my demo.php file. Um, after that, I um, apply the external CSS file to this PHP file, so make it look more professional.